Hello, welcome to Biograde TV. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification so you don't miss our next video. Biography of Sir James Richard Mary Mancham Sir James Richard Mary Mancham was a Seychellois politician who founded the Seychelles Democratic Party and was the first president of Seychelles from 1976 to 1977. Mancham's father, Richard Mancham, was a successful businessman. He ensured his son got a quality education and even sent him to law school in England. Enlightened Mancham later founded the Democratic Party SDP when Britain announced its intention to give independence to Seychelles. There was an opposition party at the time, the Seychelles People's United Party SPUP, founded by Franz Albert Rene with the support of the Soviet Union. Mancham served as chief minister of the colony and promoted tourism to the Seychelles as well as arranged for the building of the airport that made Seychelles accessible to the rest of the world. The country's economy developed as a result of the success of tourism, and in 1976, Mancham won the popular vote as head of government when the British gave the Seychelles independence. Unfortunately, in June 1977, he got the post while he was at a Commonwealth Heads of Government conference in London. This happened through a coup headed by Prime Minister Franz Albert Rene, who had the support of Tanzanian-trained revolutionaries together with Tanzanian-supplied weapons. Mancham was exiled in London until April 1992, where he became financially successful in various international business ventures. It was at this time that he married Catherine Olsen, an Australian journalist working in London. They had a son, Alexander, together. Mancham resumed the promotion of tourism when he returned to Seychelles. He ran for president in July 1993 and came second after Rene. In March 1998, he ran again, receiving third place and 13.8% of the vote, coming after Rene and Wavel Ramkalawan. Mancham wrote quite a number of books some of which were Paradise Raped, a book about the June 1977 coup d'etat in Seychelles. He also wrote War on America, seen from the Indian Ocean, written after the September 11, 2001 attacks on the United States. In 2009, he wrote his autobiography, Seychelles Global Citizen, the autobiography of the founding president, and in 2015, he wrote the saga of a small nation navigating the cross currents of a big world. Mancham also served on the advisory board of the International Journal on World Peace and was also a member of the World Future Council. He received the 2010 International Jurist Award at the inauguration of the International Conference of Jurists in Vigyan Bhawan, New Delhi, India. The event was themed International Terrorism and was jointly organized by the International Council of Jurists, the National Human Rights Commission of India, Indian Council of Jurists, and All India Bar Association. Also in 2011, Mantam was one of the recipients of the Gusi Peace Prize. He died suddenly on the 8th of January 2017, possibly of stroke. He was buried in the State House Cemetery, next to Seychelles' last French administrator, Jean Baptiste Cole de Quincy. What have we missed out of this biography of Mancham? Let's know in the comment section. Will it be ridiculous to subscribe to our channel? If no, please like this video, share, and subscribe to our channel.